Hey guys, it's Laura, and joining me today is my pal Calvin. Calvin, say hi. Look over there. Look over there. Huh? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> He's so cute. Yeah, not allowed on the bed. Stay on the floor. Anyways, um, it's been a while since I've shown you guys um, quite a big haul, and half of it is like fashion, and half of it it's like food and just snacks that I really, really like. And right now I've been on a gluten-free diet so basically I not allowing myself to eat any baked goods pasta any sort of like bread and cereal and oatmeal unless it's all like gluten-free and obviously it all comes with meat vegetables and fruits but um, once a week I do cheat that is when I go and eat whatever I want like just last week I went on a this past weekend I went on a rib fest and I had my funnel cake with like ice cream and sugar and all of that good stuff that's actually really really bad for you but it usually happens when I'm out with my friends once a week so um first I stopped at um Target and um one of the things that I bought is this L'Oreal Ever Pure sulfate free shampoo for um anti-fade system it doesn't have any harsh salts and has natural botanicals so um, it's a color care system so apparently it's very good if you have like colored hair to make sure that it's vibrant and really really nice uh, looking so I mean I really like my color right now so that's why I bought this and I'm also wearing out of my herbal essence shampoo so I'm trying that and then this is like one of my favorite snacks and I can only find it at Target it's not a Borpon, it's not a Walmart, it's not a Whole Foods, only a Target and this is Annie's cocoa and vanilla flavored cookies um, I posted an Instagram of this like a long time ago and it is the gluten free one but it is it does have rice and I do have to be careful with um, how much I eat at a time I eat like maybe like a handful like whatever I could fit in my fist like this like that's how much I have it ha that's how much I have and this is one of those snacks that I carry with me in my backpack you know when I'm in the bus you know like all of a sudden I get hang hungry hangry hungry this is one of those things that I eat um, also they had like Terra chips on sale and this is the sweets and beets and um this one is the mediterranean blend and i've never tried it before and um it was 3.99 i think it's usually like a dollar more and then um what else did i buy i also bought the Revlon Lip Butter in Juicy Papaya. I am so in love with this color. Um, this is a backup of the one that I already have. I'm keeping it in my bag just in case. So this is my old one and this is the new one. And I'm so in love with this color and I was lucky to be able to find it. It was the only one that they had at Target. I haven't seen it anywhere else. At Shoppers at Walmart, maybe it's sold out because they're really that awesome. And they did come out like two or three months ago so I'm glad that I was able to get the last one for myself so let's hide that and then after I went to trade secrets now this is a store where I buy my lashes like these lashes the echoes eyelashes my favorite ones I buy them from there and some of my nail polishes as well now, um, if you guys know about CND Shellac, it is a hybrid of nail polish and gel at the same time. You can have the system at home. You can also go and get it done professionally. I go and get it done professionally and it's like $40 every time I go. But they have a new one. It's called the CND Vilux. So it is um, a nail polish that lasts for a week. You don't need a base coat, but you have to go and purchase the top coat as well. Um and this is it right here and they both cost me 11 this, the top coat is 11.90 and the color is 11.90 as well the color that i have is sugar spice and it is the most beautiful like i don't know exactly how to to describe this color it's like a bronze gold color and it's like absolutely beautiful and there's another one that's like 
forest green with like a ton of like nice green shimmers in it. I absolutely love it. I will go and buy more in the future. Now I like this because it lasts for a week and then you get to you have the thing is you have more control in taking it off and you can take it off using acetone and um a nail polish remover with um cotton pad at home like you don't have to like put an acetone cotton pad and then like foil it at home or get it done like you know professionally and have it you know your old shellac removed professionally like this is the one that I had and I've had it for like a week now and see how it's growing and the cuticle looks so ugly and I have to keep trimming my nails like I have no control over it unless you know I start picking on it and you know start removing it here at home but I'm really excited in trying this and I'll let you guys know how I like it that will be on my hits and misses for this month and then um, I went to Bolt Barn my initial um, plan was to buy my my nuts right so first let's see where are my nuts I bought the ones without any salt in them this is mixed nuts but without any peanuts because peanuts make you bloated so it's a mix of like cashew almonds um, some walnuts in there as well and then I bought pistachios. I have to have my pistachios because they're so good and addictive. Um, these are roasted and salted ones. No big deal. It's just pistachio. And then I found this. I always rely on my friend Salabel to go and buy these cookies for me from Costco. Um, they come in a bigger box but this came in a, a smaller package. But these are like my favorite quinoa cookies i have to be careful because i have to eat like a minimal amount of like quinoa so um this is gluten-free vegan dairy and egg-free um which is good like i do eat um eggs i eat like two boiled eggs every morning and i feel really awesome even though if that's like my only breakfast like i have to have it or like my gluten-free oatmeal um, and then I also found popcorners. Um, since I already bought two bags of Terra chips, I should only just limit myself to two popcorner chips. And these are gluten free as well. It says so there at the bottom. This is the cheddar cheesy jalapeno. And this is the white cheddar. They're very, very good. Like, you guys are going to be addicted when you first try them. And then I also bought this, the Nature's Path um, Mesa Sunrise Cereal. It's gluten-free, corn, flax, quinoa, and amaranth. amaranth. So that's what it looks like, gluten-free right there. Um, yeah, and I found this at Walmart too. I found, it, found this at Walmart in... Um, they also have the gluten-free Lucy's cookies at Walmart too, just in case you guys are wondering. It's one of my friend's favorite cookies as well. And then on to fashion now. So, um, I went to Zara again. If you guys are wondering, this necklace is from Zara. I showed it on one of my previous videos. I said it was like $17 or $13, but actually it went down to like maybe $7 or $8. And I absolutely love this necklace. So, the only thing that I bought from Zara which cost me like $25 is these pair of jeans nice blue jeans they were like the only ones left and it's no big deal it's just like skinny jeans um, great length I don't have to worry about you know cutting it and this is the Zara Woman premium denim wear collection skinny slim medium rise I don't want it to be like too low rise because I have a little bit of a tummy like pouch thing you know lower tummy pouch thing going on and I need support just like your boobs need support my tummy needs support too so it lies flat you know you know um yeah I absolutely love them see it's like from like $60 to like $26 so awesome and then um, I stopped by at Aritzia again because you guys know I love Aritzia and I always take advantage of their sale but 
some of their items are like ridiculously low price which is what I'm about to show you now um, and also some of their stuff it's like ten dollars five dollars off and I'm just like that's not really a sale you know what I mean so um, let me just get my leather jacket off there I'm making a mess in my room so I'm just really happy with what I bought so first I found this skirt Honestly, guys. Honestly. So beautiful. Oh my gosh. And um, look at the detail on the skirt. Like the pleating there and this is the band. To hold everything together so you have a waist. So <laughs> this used to be $65 and then it was down to $20. And then um, one girl, she approached me and she was very helpful. I said I wanted like a nice black top to go with it. Um, this one cost me $15 from $40. And it's just a plain black tank by Wilfred Free. And this is a small because it was really square. Like this was the one that I first put on and it fit me nicely, you know. And... Pair it with nice black boots and you're good to go. And plus, like, I had a necklace on top of it too. And it was, like, the perfect, <laughs> the perfect neckline to go on top of the the top as well. See that? Um, yeah, and the brand of the skirt, sorry I wasn't able to show you guys, is Tallulah. And the size is medium. So, yeah, I used to, I, I have a lot of, like, Wilfred and Tallulah in my wardrobe right now but I always buy them on sale anyway unless I do have extra money in uh, at the moment and then you know if I see if I can afford it I have a little bit of a wiggle room in my um in my wallet then I would go and buy it but usually 90% I would say 90% of the time I only purchase my clothes from there when it's on sale <laughs> so yeah that concludes my haul for today you guys and i hope you enjoyed please um add me on facebook instagram pinterest and twitter as well if you would like all the links will be down below and also if you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for subscribe the button is like up there and thank you guys again for watching i'll talk to you later bye